Hey everyone, I'm Kamen Anchev. We start with basketball as the Bennett Academy boys are off to a red-hot 4-0 start after winning the Fenwick tip-off tournament behind some stifling defense. The Red Wings return to Lyle for the home opener against Ridgewood. A lot to smile about if you're a Bennett player. The Red Wings jump out to an early lead. David Bue with a good look to Colin Crothers with a left-handed finish. That's what you call a quality shot. Next, Red Wings possession, more good passing, and Jacob Petrovich switches home one of his two threes on the night, 5-0 Bennett. Ridgewood trying to hang around in this one, a driving dish for the deep three, that's good. Rebels down 9-6, but Bennett would go on a 7-2 run to end the quarter. Noah Farrow draws the defense and a great pass to Ben Cooney for a nice finish. The Red Wings up 16-8 after one. Bennett will continue to get good looks. Here's some defense to offense. Connor Reed picks off the pass just like he did during football season. The All-State defensive back goes coast to coast for two of his eight points. First half winding down, Ben Cooney on the drive finding Shane O'Mara for the three ball. Bennett up 33-14 at the half. Early in the third, Petrovic downloaded Crothers, who again has good post position. He scored a team high 11 points. More Bennett domination in the paint. Noah Farrow fights down low with the hoop and the harm. He had seven points. The Red Wings continue to roll. The Rebels played hard though. Michael Barnes had a game high 13 points. Here's a hand in his face and he hits the three anyways. Rebels down 12. They put the pressure on Bennett, but the Red Wings with the nifty passing to break the press. Will Angles to David Bue over to Crothers for two more. The Red Wings move to 5-0 to start the year after the 64-50 win. More basketball, the Wabonzi Valley girls have traditionally been a winning program. But in recent years, there's been a lot of losses. But there's renewed excitement with the Warriors as Brett Love has taken over as the new head coach. Love played high school basketball with former Chicago Bull Eddie Curry and then D3 college basketball at Millican University. Love had a solid 36 and 23 record as the girls coach at Hinsdale South and still coaches AAU girls basketball as well as being an individual basketball trainer for boys and girls. Love brings passion and knowledge to the court and he's got several areas in particular that he wants to change with the program. Discipline, commitment, uh, work ethic. You know, when I first came in, they didn't know how to work hard. I, that was just the, the truth of it. Um, and once they realized that, you know, we weren't doing enough, they, they realized that they can have something. The Warriors already have several wins early on in the year. You can catch the full story Sunday at 6.30 on Naperville Sports Weekly. That's sports. Kim, back to you.